Berg, welcome to Love Thank Film. You. Um, you are a man of many talents, actor, writer and mm. director, and we see you in Hancock directing. Acting in it too, I play the doctor. Do you? Did you notice that? No, I didn't. I cut myself <laughs> almost entirely out of the movie. Um, so what was it about Hancock and the script that really attracted you? I like the idea of an alcoholic superhero. I mean, really, not to be overly simple about it, thought that was a great idea. Um, the idea that this guy was terrorizing the people he was supposed to be helping, and that he was fighting crime drunk, I love. And can you imagine anyone apart from Will Smith playing, I can't imagine anyone else playing him. Tyson was one of my secret models for the character, like, in my <laughs> head. I mean, don't you think there's sort of Hancock quality to yeah. Mike Tyson? I guess so. Well, flawed, isn't he, ultimately? Flawed, capable of extreme power, um, capable of being very gentle, definitely. Ultimately, he just wants to be loved, I guess. Yeah, wants to be loved, um, doesn't know who he is, didn't know his family, mm. you know, was raised by someone that wasn't his father. Um, uh, um, like Hancock, Tyson's dealt with alcohol issues, you know, which is yeah. can do. I just thought that was an interesting, that was like a secret. Um, secret uh, side to yourself. Yeah, a secret character study I had going. And, and the film has definite a Peter Berg style, very much kind of handheld, quite a frenetic feel to it. Was that your attention from the beginning? Did we use handheld camera? I don't know if you did, but it felt like you did. I did. Fuck, I said I wasn't going to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is they, we all, the, all the money went to the special effects, so we didn't have the budget for the tripods or the dollies, mm. so we had to use handheld camera. Really? No. No. Um, and my very last question to you, Peter, um, is I'm kind of interested to know about the films that have inspired you, films that get you going. Um, the first inspiration I had was uh, the, um, the first filmmaker that really like, made me n really sit back and notice, um, at, you know, besides when I was a little kid, was John Cassavetes, um, woman like, uh, movies like Woman Under the Influence mm. with Jenna Rollins, Killing of a Chinese Bookie, um, Shadows, Movie acted in Mikey and Nicky, um, uh, even um, uh, Rosemary's Baby, which he acted. I was just a huge fan of his. Mm. Um, as a writer, director, actor, really loved his improvisational style, the looseness of his movies. Yet there was real emotion. Yeah, you know, it wasn't just so weird and disjointed that it couldn't connect to it. Um, and that that was so. He was probably the first huge influence. Is there any films of late that you've seen that you're particularly excited about? Uh, there will be blood. I'm a big fan of uh, uh, Paul Thomas Anderson. Mm. You know, you know, a young filmmaker I really like. A German film called Downfall. Yeah, excellent uh, film. Which kind of blew my mind. Um, Secret Life of Others, another German film, yep. I think, German. right? Um, I like what John Favreau did with Iron Man a lot. You know, I heard that he's not going to direct the second one. Which makes no sense to me. Doesn't make sense. No. I wouldn't believe that rumor. Um, Peter Berg, it's been a pleasure, pleasure. talking to talking you. To you. <laughs>